There's more than one way to get instant access to the apps you use most on the Alcatel Onyx. In this two-part episode, we're gonna walk you through a few options so you can pick the shortcut method that works best for you. Topic number one, lock screen shortcuts. A quick way to get to your top phone functions. Out of the box, the Alcatel Onyx comes with four lock screen shortcuts set up. Google search, phone, messaging, and camera. To go directly from the lock screen to any of these applications, all you have to do is double tap on the one of your choice. Please note, if you have a screen lock set up on the phone, you will be asked to enter that before the shortcut will open. Our four pre-existing shortcuts may not be the top four items you use on a daily basis, so let's take a look at how to customize them. Go ahead and open Settings. Scroll down and select Security and Location. Then, click on the Function Shortcuts. You'll see a menu appear where you can add, remove, or create a shortcut to an app of your choice. You can have up to five shortcuts on the lock screen at any time, so let's add Weather to the top functions list by clicking the plus sign next to that option. It should now be listed right underneath Start Camera. Let's say you want Weather to be the first function shortcut on the list. To move it, just press and hold the icon that looks like six dots and drag that function to the top of the list and let go to place it. To see what that looks like, press the power button on the side of the phone to exit the function shortcuts. Then, press the power button again to view the new weather shortcut on the lock screen. You should see it on the far left side of the screen. Go ahead and double click on that to see it work. Let's return to the function shortcuts once more to see how to remove items. To remove weather or any function shortcuts from the list, click the minus sign next to the ones you don't wish to keep. You can decide which shortcuts work best for you by scrolling through the list on the lower half of the screen to see all the options, like composing an email, adding an event, or app shortcut of your choice. If you wish to turn off the shortcuts altogether, you can also do that by toggling the switch at the top of the screen to read off. Now let's check out topic number two, fingerprint sensor shortcuts. Shortcut quicker and keep your phone secure. Another convenient method for shortcutting to key apps and functions and still keeping your phone secure is via the fingerprint sensor. Let's take a look at how this method is different from the function shortcuts on the lock screen. Open settings and select security and location. Scroll down the page and find fingerprint and click that. Select continue to acknowledge the disclaimer. If you've already set up a pin, pattern, or password, you'll be asked to enter that here. If you have no unlock method currently, you will need to set that up now. For this example, we will assume you haven't, so you can see the steps to create a fallback unlock method. As soon as you get through the backup unlock setup, you will be asked to begin placing any finger on the scanner found on the back of the phone. Move your finger around slightly to get different parts of the print by lifting and pressing down repeatedly until the confirmation appears that your fingerprint was added. Then click Done. You'll be taken to the Security and Location page, where you'll want to select Fingerprint again in order to get to the shortcuts. Input the pin, pattern, or password you just created and you will see a new menu of options. You can set up one to five fingerprints for the phone, and each one can have a different function once it's been programmed. We recommend setting up at least two different fingerprints, so you can have one to unlock the phone, and another for getting to your favorite app or function. Once you have set up a couple fingerprints, tap the slider next to Quick Launch Function Shortcuts. By turning that feature on, you will be able to choose what function or shortcut you want for each fingerprint you've registered. Click the Settings button next to any fingerprint you've registered. You will be taken to a list of function shortcuts. Each fingerprint may be assigned to one function or shortcut at any given time. Perhaps you want your pointer finger to unlock the phone, but you want your ring finger to make a call. Now you can. If you scroll down to the bottom of the list, you will see something called a trigger application which will allow quick access to your favorite application. As you can see, the shortcuts from the lock screen are not too different from those accessed via the fingerprint sensor. The major difference between the two is the fingerprint sensor unlocks your phone and launches the shortcut at the same time, keeping your phone secure without the extra step of having to enter in a pin, pattern, or password before gaining access to the application or function. If you utilize the function shortcuts from the lock screen and don't safeguard your phone with a fingerprint, pin, pattern, or password, there won't be an extra step. But we just want to make sure you know how to get to the things you use the most as fast and conveniently as possible, no matter how you manage the security on your phone. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos from Alcatel.